Now the module 3 we will see. So module 3 uh, we can start with the question number 5. So question number 5 it says is what type of invitations are eligible for patenting and which matters are considered as non-patentable. So this is nothing but patentable and non-patentable that is the that should be the topic right so model 3 patent non patentable we'll see non so we'll see the topics model to ip governance let's start with the patent Okay, this is not the complete notes. So, module 3 notes, I guess somewhere I might have missed it. Okay, guys, I'll uh, just uh, doing and just taking it. Yes, model three notes, complete notes are uh, here. Is here.
so here patentable and non patentable so in that we can always go through for uh, this thing non patentable matters okay so here we are having the two topics invention eligibility so this is the question what is the question uh, what type of inventions are eligible for patenting and which are uh, which matters are considered as profitable <coughs> so that we can so invention uh, eligibility for patent you can write that answer and then non patent eligible matter both the things you have to write so that will carry you around uh, some marks five plus five marks so total 10 marks you will get okay next question is explain the major steps involved in the process of filing process of filing a patent process of patenting okay so this is the topic and how many marks they have asked this has been asked for 10 marks oh my god so 10 marks this is a, it is a very huge topic okay so it is like a process of patenting it starts from the filing of application with ipo publishing examination grant that this you can write and there are i guess 10 subtopics prior to art of research patent database and uh, so choice of application to be filled patent application forms okay jurisdiction of filing the paper publication pre grant of uh, this thing so examination grant of a patent okay and validity of a patent production and finally so there are nine topics are there so what you can do is you just write this for 10 marks this is very important till here you write and mention all the steps there okay and explain two two points in each topic okay that will be 18 points okay and do not forget to do not explain everything do not write all these names and all but do not forget to write this flow chart of the process of filing patent this carries two marks okay and all other your 18 uh, uh, topic or uh, this thing that can be carried into 0.25 marks okay that will be around 4.5 or 5 marks and beginning this thing around 3 marks so to that will be total 10 marks hope you guys got it so explain the three uh, different types of the patent applications now types of patent application types of patent applications so this is also asked for 10 marks we are having provisional application ordinary application pct application divisional application patent additional you know, application and conventional application so this looks it's very compact answer i have made but you can elaborate it for example provisional applications a patent application filed when the invention is not fully finalized okay that means here this one point you can do now it is not fully finalized means it is it is completely the half of the work is done the another half of the work has to be done that's why we will go for provisional application why we have to go for it because it will give us uh, more time <laughs> so that uh, once we are taking a lot of time what happens the uh, uh, the newcomer or the new any new uh, uh, any new guy might get this idea that's why he might publish it that's why you are going to say that uh, before him i want to publish this data so that's why we are going for provisional application so some part of the inventions is still under ex experimentation so such type of publication helps to obtain the priority uh, priority date for the invention 
so that's what you can avoid uh, i can avoid uh, this particular the, what you say delaying of my patent or someone can come with that idea and submit it so i will uh, i cannot go for it so this these all things will be an issues so that's why you have to apply for provisional applications so that's why you hear uh, with this one paragraph i was able to explain around five to six points similarly you have to keep on explaining okay you are having one two three four five six are there you explain any five also but with definitely with a lot of uh, what you say the extra points you have to explain because 10 marks it has been asked now so that was the fifth question the sixth question explain the different types of the patent application so that was the sorry 50 now fifth b is what strategies are involved in the commercial uh, commercialization of the uh, patent okay what are the different strategies are involved in commercial commercialization is nothing but what now once you get the patent now you are going to uh, make it as commercialization a product okay so if you remember my videos when i was explaining that uh, the straw which uh, got a patent okay and now that has been commercialized right now something the same thing so it has been asked for how many mars it has been asked for seven mars so seven mars you are having what is commercialization how to do a patent owner may grant a license to a third party like for example companies and all that okay the reasons can be like this all these things you can explain definitely there are more than 7 14 points you can explain you will get enough for to get the five marks what are the utility models okay so utility models and how do they differ from the patents that is a good question actually so the answer is again utility models in many cases the invention was in the incremental improvements over the existing products but this technical improvement is not sufficient enough to pass the stringent of criteria for novelty so that means it cannot be a patent because that is something just value added it is a utility model that means it is upgraded one but not for you cannot patent it so there are i guess there are seven points and mars five marks so five marks only is in a powerful topics you can explain so that is about the module three okay so we will see stay tuned for module four and module five i will upload it by today only